scan on people today we have linear this is going to be one of the most comprehensive guides on farming linear out there this could be one of the biggest airdrops ever we cannot fade this one there are going to be five figure airdrops left right and center with linear they raised 730 million a crazy stupid amount it's built by the metamask team so this is basically metamask's chain it's a consensus layer two chain and to be farming this so hard over the next few months the token probably launch in q2 q3 so we've got time i've just relaunched their voyager where you can do tasks to earn, to earn the lxp token i think it's lxp which 99 percent will convert directly into the linear token gonna lie they are farming the hell out of the farmers but this one is worth it for sure these big layer twos linear scroll zk maybe base layer zero we want to give every bit of attention and grind possible because they are going to be the biggest airdrops of the year all right let's get going so first we are going to farm the lxp tokens all right so it's called linear park as you can see there's different different um tasks different sections to the park that are going to open up over the next coming weeks at the moment there are just these um the welcome four quizzes that you can do and that will get you 30 xp points or LXP tokens, sorry. And then they've got a game unlocking, or well, it looks like it's already unlocked, so we can play the game now to get some more LXP. You have to do a POH to be able to come into the linear park and do these tasks. POH, proof of human. I know a lot of people don't like doing this, but I personally do because it gets out of the gets all gets rid of all the bots and that means more money for us with anything in life the more effort and work you put in the bigger the rewards so i am willing to put in as much work needed to get these five figure airdrops it's not too difficult to get done i'm going to show you the easiest the easiest ones to do so you can get your proof of human and start getting these lxp tokens which will basically be guaranteed airdrop you want to be using a main wallet to do this linear is safe all good we want to be using a wallet that has the most amount of volume going through it but what you need to do is you so say you've got group a and you need to verify with one of the one of these in group a and then you need two in group b so i did zk pass coinbase kyc so i've got an account with coinbase so it's really simple you just need to sign into your coinbase sign a transaction and you will get verified so if you've got a coinbase account you can do that if you've got an okx account you can do that also trust i would probably probably be the next easiest one to do and then pado labs gitcoin is the hardest so yeah the kycs are the easiest then trust her. i didn't look at um the uber trips one so that one might not be too hard either but yeah, do the one that is easiest for you to get done as quick as possible. And then in group B, sorry, in group B, OX score is the easiest one to do. Um, so this just gives your wallet a score. You need above 50. This is why you need to use a main wallet because it's going to be based on transactions, volume, and not looking like a bot. So OX score was quick, took me a minute cost a dollar or something my score was well above 50 so i got that and then the next easiest one was open id and open id was just signing a transaction this is it here connect your wallet sign a transaction connect your a google email account and that was that and then you will have your proof of human and then you'll be able to get into the linear park and start doing these tasks so yeah this is a must for getting this linear airdrop for all these big layer ones layer twos they're gonna have a proof of human because they're trying to get out of these bots and as i said i personally agree with that the bots shouldn't be getting in on these airdrops when we're sitting here actually putting work in and using their daps and as well we're going to do a whole load of farming maneuvers within the linear ecosystem they will probably airdrop lxp to people that meet the criteria on a certain amount of transactions unique contracts volume and so let's get right into that step-by-step -step guide. It's gonna be comprehensive, like I said. We're gonna make sure that we get a five-figure airdrop. Okay, so first we need to bridge over to Linear. We'll get us our first transaction and obviously get some funds on the Linear chain. So you can use the official Linear bridge. 
They only have ETH. You can only bridge from ETH to Linear. So the gas fees will be a bit pricey. So up to you if you use Linear Bridge. You don't have to. We can also use Orbiter, which also have an, has an ongoing airdrop at the moment. If I can find it. Oh, yeah, if you don't want to be spending money on gas fees, I mean, using Linear Bridge is ideal. And we should probably do both. So if you can do the linear bridge, but if you can't, then just use Orbiter. It's still going to count as a bridging transaction. Bridge from ZK Sync so that I get a transaction going from ZK Sync as well. So a two for one right there. So gas fee is going to be much lower. And then we're going to get points for using the Orbiter bridge as well. As you can see up here, they have a points system. They have an airdrop, a confirmed airdrop coming. So if you was to use ZK Sync bridge to linear, and obviously we're using Orbiter, we're getting a free for one within one transaction. All right, and then we're going to be using Echo Dex to do some swaps to get some volume going. So Echo Dex also has an airdrop. They have the airdrop tab here. They have points for swapping, for um, providing liquidity or staking. So another two for one within one transaction. So do some swaps back and forth. We want to be coming back weekly or every other week to just do some swaps. Also, if you can, you want to add to a pool, which will have APR. So you'll be making a little bit on the APR if you provide to a pool. And then providing to pools on a chain holds a lot of weight and will um, bump you up in the rankings. Okay, then we're going to go to NFTs to me. We're going to create a NFT drop so that we are a NFT creator in case that's one of their criterias in the airdrop, aside from doing the tasks to earn the LX, LX um, token. So you just need to project name, token symbol, little description, upload an image, um, set your minting fee to whatever you want for that if someone was to buy it and deploy and obviously make sure that you're on linear. I've created a collection where you can come and mint 10 NFTs. So it'll be 10 unique contracts. Unique contracts hold a massive amount of weight within these chains. So I've set it to two cent per NFT. So it'll cost 20 cent plus the gas fee, which will be really low. So it'll be about a dollar. And then we can also mint a domain with linear name service. So just put in your domain that you want to do. It will pop up and then mint it. And it is around $10 to mint a domain. I would definitely recommend getting a domain as well. So if you can come and do this quickly, of course, none of this is financial advice. So make sure you do your own research. But the next one would be to use Layer Bank and do some lending and borrowing. Lending and borrowing holds a lot of weight as you're putting funds into the chain. So I always do this within the chains that I'm trying to farm. And I have a technique, a way of doing it where you can keep the, keep the liquidity. So what you would do is you would lend USDC and then borrow USDC. So if you put $500 in and lend USDC, you'd be able to then borrow 400 USDC. So you've got no risk of being liquidated as obviously the price of the token can't go up and down. I mean, there is a small risk if USDC collapsed, then you would be liquidated, but that is highly unlikely. So it's pretty safe in terms of not being liquidated and you can keep that money liquid. You can then you, uh, take that money and use it somewhere else. You know, from 500, you could lend it here, then borrow 400, then go to another lending platform that's given out points that hasn't got a token yet lend that 400 borrow 300 back and so on and then use that 300 to go and farm whatever project you want to farm Just make sure that you're doing it in stable coins don't do eth or any token that is going to be volatile because you're going to be at high risk of being liquidated you also earn points through layer bank that will give you access to airdrops there's a points tab here and um this will be airdrops within the linear ecosystem so you will earn points. So this opens you up to more airdrops as well. If you did want to supply on Layer Bank, then you would come down to the bottom, choose what you want to supply, USDC, supply, make sure it's available as collateral if you're also going to borrow. 
and then hit supply. Once you've done that, that would then show up here. And if you wanted to borrow, you would click on it and you would go to borrow. Said so none of this is financial advice. Make sure you know what you're doing. Make sure you do your own research. Make sure that you are comfortable with losses. I only do this with stable coins to make it as safe as possible and then be able to utilize those funds as much as possible. And if you're not comfortable with borrowing and opening yourself up for liquidation, then just supply. You can just supply. There's no risk of liquidation. Obviously, there's the risk of the platform itself getting hacked and whatnot. As with everything in crypto, everything is a risk. All right. And then the last thing that we are going to do is we're going to deploy a token contract. So on Third Web, you're going to go to the Explore tab. You're going to go down to Token. You're going to go to Deploy Now. Put a name in, symbol. A description if you want upload a logo if you want choose a linear network down here and then deploy a, it's a couple dollars to deploy the contract once you've deployed it you'll be taken through to the overview page of your contract you then want to mint tokens on the contract to complete it so mint tokens whatever supply doesn't matter it's another dollar or two dollars all right and then if you want to keep track of how you're doing within a chain you can use ZK code, so you'll input your address here, choose whatever chain you want, so linear, obviously, for this one, and it will break down how you're doing in relation to other users. So there's like a point system, and it's showing you if you're in the top 10, 15, 20, or 50% of users within the chain, and it will predict the size of the airdrop that you could potentially get, and they're using Arbitrum to predict the size of the airdrop. So it's nice just to see where you maybe need to improve. With Linear, it has the proof of human. As I said, this is vital to getting this airdrop. Even if you wasn't doing the, the Linear Park tasks, if you didn't do the proof of human and you did all of the, the transactions, you probably won't get airdropped. So you have to do that proof of human. Yeah, it's, it's good to just keep, um, keep you on track, shows you unique contracts. So I have 17 NFT mints, fees, volume and then if you come down it shows you an arbitrum simulation so if this was arbitrum it's showing that i'd right now be getting 1250 it gives you a score three out of four years, so i've got a lot of work to do breaks down what you haven't done so that you can focus on what you need to do yeah nice little tool just to make sure that you're staying on track with the tokens or the chains sorry that you are farming yeah. my peeps and that wraps this one so that's linear 730 odd million raised the airdrops are going to be huge we want to make sure that we are doing everything possible ticking every box to get in on this airdrop out a post earlier stating that this is the golden era of airdrops these airdrops won't last forever this next six to 12 months is probably going to be a period of the biggest airdrops ever in crypto and the last period of it so we need to be going a hundred thousand percent at the moment everything we've got no sleep we can sleep once we've made our life changing money i'm going to be bringing you every possible way of getting these airdrops let's do it together any questions you need any help leave it in the comments i will get back to you and help you like and subscribe to stay up to date with the alpha and i will catch you in the next have 